All right, welcome to this channel. Basically, I got to plow through these really fast because there's 24 Valkyries. So even if I did one per day, that's still three weeks of content, more than three weeks. So maybe in some days I'll do double uploads. We'll see. I feel like HOS is pretty easy, fairly easy, I would say. She can build basically anything and I use like kind of a dog build. Like she's literally not even dependent on her Ellie Sigs. Sigmata and equipment are super flexible as well. You don't need direct. You can use pretty much any, like your best physical gear will work. I use a foundry weapon to show that the weapon doesn't really matter either. Buffs and supports are also pretty straightforward. Just take lightning empress and snowy the whole way. So now I'll just cut to me in the past. All right. I kind of feel like I need to do HOS. She's a pretty, I mean, everyone has her, right? <laughs> if you don't have her at this point, uh, well, she might be the fastest route to a high difficulty clear. So I'm going to do her real quick. Uh, again, max SP. I'm going to take crit damage and melee damage because she is actually melee. Uh, whoops. Let me see. Where is she? So let's make things uh, practical, shall we? I'm going to be using... Uh, these gloves. These are foundry weapons. You can get them in the foundry. Um, I'm not going to use shattered swords. We'll use direct just like... Uh, hold on, actually. Do I have it saved? I did. This is kind of close. Let me use... Let me see. Here we go. Foundry weapons. And direct. It's just a great ER set, honestly. If you want to like main ER, you gotta have a you gotta have a direct set. It's just a quality stick mana, honestly, for pretty much any physical damage dealer. Because it, it can impair with the three set, which I think people underestimate. I mean, obviously you need to be burst mode. Uh, I think uh, Mihoyo realizes how strong burst mode is in this mode. All right, I'm gonna take this and uh, Jingwei Elf. I don't think she uses chariot very well, but that's fine for us. It's fine for us. We'll use Blood Rose. Or should I use... No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, Blood Rose. No. Should light... I think Light Empress might be a little bit better. She's a little bit SP hungry. Let's... I'm not going to lie. All right, let's 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 do this. Let's do this. Uh, one second. I can't believe they actually gate you out of the <laughs> Elysian Realm for doing the story. I mean, I get it. They want you to do... But still, it's a little cumbersome, I would say. All right, so what we want to take is the 18 slashes, which is this one. And uh, my goal here is just to take Eden. I think you, if you saw the Blade Strike video, you know exactly what I'm trying to do here. Which is just to, yeah, it's essentially what we're doing is we're, we're maintaining high SP and maintaining the buff. Now... Actually, HOS does not use Eden quite as well as Blade Strike. I would actually claim, I know this is a hot take, that HOS is kind of weaker than Blade Strike because of that. Being able to use Eden is so important. It's such a good uh, signet. Of course, for floor, what floor am I on? I'm floor one right now. Floor one doesn't really matter for obvious reasons because we don't have Eden. But uh, floor two and onwards, yeah. Certainly you want uh actually Blade Strike doesn't take Emperor too because she needs two LE six. But for HOS, yeah, we definitely need um we're gonna be using 125 SP at the start, which kinda sucks for us. Just kinda not good. Whatever. I think fundamentally she's stronger, but uh in terms of Okay, we're gonna looking for Eden here. For Eden. That's also interesting, but uh, now Eden is uh, the only thing that really matters here. Grind SP. I'm actually just going to keep. I'm just going to keep doing this. I'll save my. Uh, what is it called? I don't know what it's called. Sorry. It's uh, my. Dirac? Is that what I'm trying to say? Okay, sorry. This is a little bit weird. So, yeah, keep SP high. And your damage will be high. Because that's just kind of how Eden works. I 
I think this is fine. I'll just rush this out. Yeah. So floor, uh, what is this? Three, I think? This is where we get three set Eden. Even if I miss the two set stick, uh, what is it called? I think that's B for a second. That's going to be good for us. Two sigs, we're probably fine. So that's P per second actually really helps. I need to grind as much SP as possible here. So Eden's gonna help us here. Okay, I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna use Eden as well, the, the active. I don't actually know if I'm gonna be able to clear this floor, but we'll see. My hope is that I will. I think I should be able to, but the unfortunate thing here is that I could, I'm actually pushing them away from that thing. Okay, I am able to use my ult right away because of the SP per second, which is good. But uh, let me see, let me see. Oh, that's annoying. Maybe we can do this, but I just need to play better. I'm, I might retry once if I if I fuck up. Okay, <laughs> let's do this. I think I think we should might we might be good. We might be good. We'll see. Use the weapon active here for direct T. Okay. Hopefully this works out, but I'm a little bit skeptic right now. Okay, I, I I'm gonna I might reset because I feel like it's possible. But uh Okay, one one reset, we'll see, we'll see. I'm 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 a little bit skeptic, but uh, my play was not good and also the first Eden stage kinda of, kinda of bad. Let's, let's let's not let's not play around. Let's not skirt around the idea that it was good, because it wasn't. I didn't mean to do that. Whatever. Uh, I think it might be okay, personally. Let's just see how this goes. Hopefully they stay in Eden stage. This could be good for us. Because they are kind of staying in it. Because I'm regening SP, I'm actually... Scaling in damage as well. Oh no. Okay, I need to like, evade and attack manually. Okay, there we go. A little bit weird, but uh, I do need the SP regeneration for obvious reasons. Let's use this. Extend it a bit. I think maybe I should save my evasion skill. That seems like the right play. And here we're going to get rid of this guy. And hopefully I'm going to save my snowy. Let's see where this takes us. Okay, I'm gonna evade. I'm gonna use the stage. I'll evade. Do that. I need to use ult one more time. Okay. Hopefully this is enough. I think it will be, but I could be wrong, which will be shocking. Okay, good, good, good. Just the power of using Eden at high SP is just super strong. Okay, now we need the total damage multiplier. This is great for us. What do I need here? Uh, always take initial max SP. That's fucking great for obvious reasons. Take Eden too. We're good. We're looking pretty here. <clears throat> Bodhi is decent for us. But I don't know if I'm like willing to take it right away. Uh, because uh, Bodhi just alone is kind of cringe. I'm just going to go to the shop and see what I can find in there. 
I think that's a fair uh, assessment of the situation. Let's see what we got here. Deliverance is okay. Stars is great. Let me see what we got. Physical Breach. Maybe I do, Kevin. Combo heads. Evasion skill. Ooh, Sakura. I just, I forgot about Sakura, to be honest. Sakura's great on her. Actually really great on her. Oh, yeah, I don't have any sickness to upgrade. Uh, yeah, I mean, I want the Breach as well, though. Hmm. Call me crazy. I think we take both of these. Maybe a Bodhi I would have liked if I saw a Bodhi door, but... I'm going to go Griseo, actually. We're going to take Evasion Skill Boost Total Damage Taken by All Enemies. I think that's kind of just great on her. Physical Breach is great on her. And Griseo here is going to help us quite a lot, actually. I, I think I'll keep the Eden Signet stage. It's quite good. Uh, hmm. Let me look at this once last time. Yeah, Griseo makes sense. Actually, does it make sense? Maybe I go with Kevin? No, no, no. The red and hot multiplier is just so good. Uh, and even if you get yellow, it's also quite decent. It's just a generally decent set. I, I think I've underestimated it in the past. It's just good. Like, when I first saw it, I was like, this is kind of weird. And why would anyone use it? But after uh, doing a bit of research and understanding how it works, honestly, goaded. Uh, I'm going to... Sorry. Losing my train of thought while talking. I don't know how streamers talk while they play. That's kind of crazy. Kind of cracked. I'm practicing, though, as you guys can see. It's a little bit of a practice. I, I don't generally think I'm a good streamer. But hopefully after I do all the Valkyries, I'm a bit better. Oh, shit. Okay. I... I okay. I, I have mixed feelings about this. I'm going to save my my stage thing for the next stage because it is the uh, two times signet, which is pretty important to focus on. It's pr it's fairly important. Yellow is good. It's fairly important to get the two times signet. I mean, it's not that important, but if you want to flex for time. Okay, Sakura is great for me. Just Just great for me. She uses soccer so well. Go. I want to grind a bit more SP before I go all out. Okay. I'm going to use this. It should be good. In fact, I'm fairly sure it will be. Probably shouldn't have used the pillar. But, uh... Yeah? It's actually good I didn't use my evasion right away, because... I can use it now to refresh it. I'm gonna save my pillar for the next wave. Great. Use pillar, weapon active, now I have my three set back. Just bonk him to death. They, okay, I probably shouldn't have done that, but it's fine. Because I do have one soccer signet. Might actually... Hmm. This might be a little bit close, not going to lie. I'm gonna use this. I need to be careful here. Okay, fuck it. I just kind of need to go in. I might have to reset here because I, I didn't play it exactly perfectly. Yeah, hold up. I, I, okay. My bad. Gosh. Didn't play it perfect. So here's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna just use everything here. Including Snowy Sniper. I'm going to use... Um, 
Just three combos, because that's the quickest SP per second thing I can do. Okay, what the fuck. Nice, bro. I mean, could you, can you ask for a more annoying enemy? I don't think so. Uh, definitely not. Use chains, weapon, ult. I would pillar, but I kind of feel like I need to save that until they're in the seed mode, yeah. Because the seeds, they like to bounce, man. I don't like it. I don't like how they bounce. I don't much appreciate it. Okay. Okay, we'll just do this. That's fine. I, I think this is the main target anyway, is the smelter zombie. He's a goddamn annoying one. Okay, I don't know why you're there. Okay. I have Snowy up, which is great for me. Okay, I'm going to use this. Okay. Hopefully that's enough damage. Just barely made it. Just barely. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I think what we want... Uh, I mean, total damage is great. I like the second one as well. This is kind of goaded for Sakura 2. But do I want Sakura 2? Do I want Sakura 2? I don't think it really matters for me. Okay, we'll take the total damage first and foremost. Uh, I kind of like the SP, but the S this is basically like more SP, right? The the second. Uh, I like Soccer One, but Soccer Two is kind of nice. No, Soccer One. I mean, it, Soccer Two only really works for people who don't have the ability. I kind of like Alicia here. This is kind of a bit lucky. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Eden. Eh, no, I think I'm done with Eden, to be honest. We'll just go Alicia. Just just makes the most sense. So when we get Alicia, we are able to get uh, the clone, which is kind of goaded. What the clone allows us to do, in essence, is um, build Mobius, which is super nice. Uh, Mobius is one of the strongest Cygnus, I would say. If you're able to use it effectively, but uh, not many Valkyries can. It's a pretty niche Stigmata. Uh, Stigmata. Signet. Pretty niche. But uh, because she can use it, um, it, may, it kind of carries her a bit. We'll use this. And, uh, weapon active ult. This is good for us. Uh, speed is okay. I like it. I mean, I won't brag about it. It's not that amazing is what I'm trying to say, but uh, it's there. It's there. Let's uh, bonk you into submission. Thank you. All right. Let me see. What do we got? Hopefully get the clone here. There we go. I do like the clone. Now we can build Mobius, which is kind of great for us. Uh, but we didn't get Mobius here. We got uh, Zoomer Sigs, which I don't like most of them, to be completely honest. I think most of them are kind of too niche. Uh, aside from... Uh, Griseo might be the only one that's actually good. Vilvi is kind of decent if you can spam your weapon, but uh, it's like kind of... I'm going to go to the shop because I feel like I don't like the selection and I can get... Uh, Maybe more opportunities come up with the shop. Hopefully there's like a Mobius shows up here, please. Oh, nice. Oh, there's a Lissidor as well, though. I'm more inclined to go Mobius here. Oh, this is even better for me. Actually, no, it's not. Shit. Yeah, I, I can't actually, because this is not the double signets door. Well, that's unfortunate. 
Oh, uh, Bodhi. Interesting. Ooh, I can get three set Bodhi. Is that even better? I think it is. I think it is. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Uh, I don't even want to upgrade my Signets. I just want uh, these two. We'll take these two first and foremost. Oh, I can take another one. Ooh. This is good, right? Weapon active restores 12 SP and reduces the cooldown, which is honestly just good. Physical breach per second is... Eh. I mean, it's all right. It's all right. It also allows me in the future, if there's like a double door, like say, say after this, I find a Hua. What ends up happening is if I get the double signet, I'll be able to build three set Hua. So this actually ends up being okay. I'll take the breach. I also don't have any breach in my kit yet. Oh, I never mind. I do, but it's only for five seconds. Okay. Do I keep the... I guess I do keep that. I just generally like the signet, to be honest. I'm going to I'm gonna go to Bodhi here. Because I have two Bodhis. Now I can set three set Bodhi, which is great for me. Great for me. I kind of want the SP regen from it, though. Right now I don't have that, which is kind of cringe. Let's do this. Oh, I should be using my evade. I don't know why I'm not. What a silly person I am. Okay. I need to group these guys. Group them pretty bad. They're in an annoying position. I'll save Eden for the next stage. Obvious reasons. Obvious reasons. Okay, what's the next floor? Is this? Okay. I'm going to use Snowy here. Okay. Let's get our direct set up. All right. All right, so now now we have three set Bodhi, which is great. Great for us. I want the SP, but uh, I almost want like, hmm, I'm conflicted about this selection. Like how important is the SP? It's pretty important, right? It puts us at max all the time. I'm going to go for it. I feel like the SP is like the the main reason why you even take Bodhi in the first place. Bodhi too. So, what do we have? Uh, it doesn't stack as, as fast as you would like. Eden's good. I think, do I take Eden or do I take Bodhi here? Because I, I think... Mm, if I consider the fact that I can't keep Eden as up as often as I would like. I think Bodhi kind of works better because at least with Bodhi, I can get the 60 combo hit plus the total damage, which is decent for us. I get a little bit lucky. I mean, gold is kind of good because it gives you the SP regen plus the... Uh, do I have anything I'm missing from this? Not really. Now, we could actually... Hmm... No, no, no. I think Bodhi, it just makes more sense. Because it, I, I, it's a little bit... I feel like Bodhi's a little bit of a greedy Signet, to be honest. I'm just going to I'm just gonna say it. It's a bit of a greedy Signet. Let's use this. It's a greedy Signet. Like, right now, I don't get it up as much as you would like. Which is more unfortunate than fortunate. Let's do this. Will you do enough damage here, but I could be wrong. Oh my gosh, that's not what I wanted. Whatever. Playing a little bit weird right now. It's okay. Not having direct B up is alright, because I have Bodhi with the SP regen, but... Uh, I should be able to get the three set, which is fine. I'm gonna group these guys real quick. 
group you, weapon active, evade. Alright, it's a little bit weird. Gonna use this. I think it's kind of important for us. Actually, not really, but might, have, might as well go out with a bang. Well, we make it, I think. Okay, that wasn't really close. We definitely make it. Uh, what do we take here? What do we take here? Definitely want this. This is maybe, perhaps, even more important. Perhaps even more important is that 60. Uh, what do we take now? I kind of like this, but the total damage is, is just too much. 55%. Like, do you really... Okay, Mobius is just the play. No question about it. No question. Mobius is the play. Uh, yeah. I mean, I've, been, I've been thinking about Mobius for such a long time, but only now I've been able to get it. Okay, let's use this. Okay, I need to actually group you guys. Okay. Okay, and now I'm able to do this, which is fantastic. Let me get my direct set back up. All right, let's go. Actually, kind of taking a long time, to be fair. I feel like, yeah, this is why I feel like she's, uh, I mean, I mean, to be fair, I'm using a three-star weapon, but certainly there's stuff to be, there's, there's, it's left to be desired the da on the damage side. She's not exactly the strongest character in the Listener Realm. She's definitely... She can hold her own weight, and I feel like she's pretty practical. But in terms of, like, raw DPS... Eh, maybe we'll see We'll see better damage after I get Mobius. But being dependent on a certain signet says not exactly... Uh, how do I say this? It's not pretty in roses. It's not a saying. What am I saying? being a little bit of a papega right now should be enough to kill though which is uh, I mean what more do you want okay we killed the yellow mech oh you know the best thing about HOS is that she's super easy god damn it I'm trying to talk here half she's super easy like you just it's super easy you only need to hold down the attack button like how practical is that how practical is that? Okay, Mobius here. I do like the first one. The second one is great, but only when you actually have the three sets. Now, the, I would take Mobius here, but the problem is it's only one. I only have one of Mobius, which sucks. So I will go to the shop. I think the shop is just uh, a great place to be. Can I get Infinity? Okay, I can reset for it though. Or if Kevin shows up, I'm I'm down. I have I have two. I have two. I have I can make Kevin two, which is great for us. Uh I don't what else is good here? What else is good here? Absolutely nothing is good here. Fantastic. But I will take Kevin. We can take the Kevin two. And I can pray that we get Mobius. In fact, I might actually just put this goddamn thing. I really want to make sure I get Mobius after this. Uh, I would. I won't be okay with Hua. I don't like Hua that much. Mobius needs to happen. But Kevin two is good here. Like we'll take a Kevin two. Uh, hmm. Let's see what else can I take. I think I already saw all of these. They're just bad. Let me see what I can upgrade. Upgrading, I think... Uh, these are cringe. Why? <laughs> Why is there nothing good? What kind of... Sh this is the worst shop ever, by the way. Just saying. Uh, we'll take this. We'll upgrade that. Why not? Why not? 
don't think that's a good upgrade. This is okay. I don't think I need more SP right now. So, I mean, 11% or taken for 49. Uh, can't upgrade both, but... Maybe I can upgrade the physical breach on along with it. Fine. Uh, total damage? Fine. Fine. I will go for Kevin here, like I said before. Kevin 2 is... Uh, it's not great, but it's decent for us. And if I get Mobius after this, we're sitting... Pretty nice. Okay, I don't know why I delayed that so off. Like, I don't know what I'm trying to say, to be honest. All these imaginary enemies are pretty tanky. You know, I might not get the double signet, and I might have just bamboozled myself right now. Potentially, that's exactly what happened, but, uh... Okay. Let's see where we're sitting now. I, I won't say this is a fast clear time, because that would be wrong, but... I will say it's fast enough. And isn't that what really matters here? Okay. God damn it. Fair enough. I, I, I'm, I'm a little nervous. I don't think I'm going to get the two signets now. I feel like the damage is kind of... It's just not good enough. Physical damage. And we're taking Kevin 2 here. Because I want it to be permanent. Can I get infinity? Thank you very much. Uh, infinity is obviously the choice here. I wish I got it instead of Kevin earlier. But uh, whatever. Do I have SP per second, Kevin? I do. Okay. So actually makes perfect sense to just ult because I'll get permanent SP regen which is fantastic for me I need to get my 50 hits in though should be fine there we go okay I'm just gonna use this once again actually that was probably stupid probably stupid let's be real Okay. Admittedly, I don't think I'm going to get this. Um, these guys are super tanky, and I just don't have the damage. Just don't have the damage. Also, the grouping is fucking annoying. I hate imaginary enemies so much, dude. Uh, like, you thought quantum enemies were bad? God, at least quantum enemies encourage, like, evade gameplay. Imaginary enemies are just, like, a goddamn HP sponge. No counterplay. Uh, it's cl it's pretty clear which one is the better design choice. At least to me. Like, quantum enemies, I feel like, are a pretty smart design choice. Imaginaries be like, uh, let me just give you cancer. I guess there's some, like merit to them because they can they're, they're, uh, there's ways to get him th them to the sea right away but it's just i don't know i don't like it it's just cringe all right we're not getting it we're not getting mobius uh i i mean the goal is not to get a fast time the goal is to show a practical run at least in my opinion this is pretty practical it's like my first attempt doing hos today I think HOS might be one of the most practical Valks to use. And if you don't think so, you're just wrong. You're just wrong. Like, this is so easy. I'm not even, like, real. I could just pay attention to my talking. Unlike Blade Strike, which I played earlier, and I was like, I, I gotta optimize this and that and this and that. 
This is just like, it's just chill. It's just chill. Um, having a good time. I could watch anime in the background if I wanted to. I was watching, um, okay, hold up. Let me just get my direct up. I was watching Akabi's Sailor Uniform. It's a good show. That's what I'll say. It's a good show. I feel like it's better than Komi-san. Am I crazy for thinking that? I think it's just better. Like, it's like almost the same concepts, but it's just straight up better. I'll take the cooldown reduction. Okay, uh, what do I want? Okay, so, uh, I mean, looking back to our signets, we have Kevin. We have Eden. We have Bodhi. <laughs> Sakura. And I wish we got Mobius. I wish. Grisea would have been nice, too. I always get, for some reason, I always get yellow when red is, like, strictly better. Unfortunate. I know. But, I mean. Potentially. What an annoying boss. Okay. This guy has more vulnerability to freeze now than he does later, which is weird. It is weird. I'm not going to say that it's, it's not weird because it is. Man, I hate this boss. Okay. I hate it and love it at the same time. Because I feel like it's a good boss if you're using a character that can actually evade. But if you're using a character that will get punished for evading, like HOS, uh, it's fucking cringe. Because you can't evade his attacks and you just get tainted for no reason. And the only thing you can do is, if you want to evade, you end up actually losing damage. Because you need to bonk the entire duration, which is... It's just annoying, man. Can't really play around it. Whatever. Well, uh, I mean, if that freeze tremo stays, I will be able to actually get another freeze on him, which is great for me. Why am I getting tainted? I mean, I know you love tainting me and all, but, like, why am I getting tainted right now? He just, if you're just, like, generally around him, you just get tainted. It's insane. Okay. Did he just, like, remove his freeze trauma? What the fuck was that? Or does it decay? I don't really get it. He's gonna taint me. I know, you piece. I know you would. Okay, I mean... Okay, whatever, man. I think the chains actually slow down the, the clock on the timer. Potentially. I'm going to save my weapon to extend it. Like, right now? Okay. Good, 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 good. This might be my time to shine. Do not... Okay, I need to get him out of this now. Okay. Ah! Uh. I will admit. Very mm, not pog was this run. I think Alicia would be a mistake, right? Alicia would definitely be a mistake. Because there's so many things I can't actually like control. Maybe I do Kalpas here. Maybe that's the play. Huh. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do Mobius. Fuck it. Even though I don't have Griseo. Fuck it. 
That's what I'm saying. I feel like I can group the little shits easily. Ends up being okay for me. Generally. Is the I don't get it. I don't even have Griseo. How is Mobius taking so much damage? Maybe I'll maybe I'm gonna eat those words. Maybe. Perhaps. Let's see. I I probably will eat my own words. That's what I'm thinking right now. But uh let's see, let's see. How much damage am I gonna do here? Without Snowy. Ah, uh, the damage is not great. That's what I'll say. But it's not terrible either. Let's just get these plays. Why are you so tanky at this very moment? Oh, I don't have direct set, of course. Yeah. All right. Fair enough. I'm gonna save Snowy for when Mobius shows up. Like, and now. Should be able to get another snowy later. I'm gonna wait a bit before I go all out. Like, now. Get my direct B. This is a little bit mold, I'm not gonna lie. A lot more work than I thought it would be. Okay. <clears throat> Let's group them. Wow. We'll be able to get one more snowy proc. I don't know why. This is actually much easier than clock was. Because probably because I'm not getting tainted 24 fucking 7. That's probably what's going on there. Although I'm not exactly in the best the best of positions. That attack does a lot of damage, actually. Snowy here. Should be able to clear this. Uh relative this one's a lot easier than the clock, in my opinion. I, I, it's just because the clock is so crazy. Maybe HOD is the play. Because the clock... Uh, I have mixed feelings about that, actually. Because if I go HOD, then I, I lose the melee damage or something. Whatever, it's fine. I just feel like the taint mechanic is so annoying for HOS. Okay, this should be it. Generally a pretty slow ending, but uh, I feel like because I didn't get Mobius at the end there, it was kind of bad. Especially for Clock and Mobius. I think those are those two bosses are super annoying. Uh, but, uh, I mean, pretty... Eh, it's decent. I mean, considering I had a... Three, two star? Was it a three star weapon? Three star weapon, sorry. It was all right. I would say just, I, I feel like I needed to put more emphasis on Mobius there. Unfortunately, I didn't, I wasn't able to get it. Mobius would help you a lot, is what I'll say about that. But I mean, it uh, even without Mobius, I was able to clear, which is kind of cool. Kind of cool. Uh, I'll, I'll show the build once again. Once again. Uh, this is in the Foundry. And it's just classic Dirac.